The first topic is being fertile and increasing your fertility. I was on a little vacay in Delaware and I was at this random farmer's market in kind of the middle of nowhere. It probably had like 10 vendors and it was super cute. And I happened to stumble upon a table where a woman had a lot of different teas, so loose leaf tea. And of course I was excited about it because I have aspirations of drinking loose leaf tea every morning, which mm, doesn't happen, but I really enjoy it. So I was chatting with her and my friend was as well and we realized that she had different types of tea for women that are breastfeeding um, or you know in different stages of either being a mom um, or trying to become a mom. And so I didn't really think that this was going to be applicable for us, but then I found one of her teas, which I have here. And it's called um, Fertile Tea, or let's see, oops. It's like Fertile Lee Tea. You know, me and my pronunciation, it's not great. Um, and it basically says that it balances the hormones and enhances fertility. And um, which I think is fantastic because I host a meetup in the DC area every month and we talk about a lot of things um, egg freezing related. So a lot of women are trying to make the decision to freeze their eggs. It's a very complicated one. It involves, you know, financial decisions, um, decisions about even if you want to become a mother um, and also a lot of steps along the way. So we won't get into that right here, but I share all that because some women, the first step of freezing your eggs is understanding where you are in terms of your f fertility and your reproduction health. And so there's a test you can take, which I think that everyone should take in their 20s because every woman's reproduction and health system is different. And I'm not sure why this doesn't exist in our normal um, doctor appointments, but we're working on that. Um, but it will tell you where you are and how your fertility is doing and if you're having fertility decline, which we don't even know is happening and can be happening. So some women that are going to try to freeze their eggs are already um, in fertility decline. And so they're trying to increase their fertility so that they can freeze as many eggs as possible. I feel like I went the really long way of saying all of that. So here's a product that I think you could enjoy, um, you know, maybe every morning uh, to increase your fertility. I'm gonna blog a little bit more about it. The woman that started it, she actually makes it in the US, um, which of course we love supporting local businesses. And she's been um, in Forbes, um, has had major press um, all over the US. So she's super cool. We'll try to get her uh, in an interview on the blog. Fingers crossed, we'll see. And a little bit more about our tea is that the company is called Euphoric Herbals. You can find it online. Um, and they actually produce tea for four different things. So it's basically pregnancy, postpartum, breastfeeding, and family. And so the owner that I met, her name is Cindy Collins, and she's been uh, in the Forbes article, which I will also post below. It says how she went from serving in the Air Force to making herbal tea and running her own company. So she's just a really cool lady. I think you'll find her very interesting. We'll try to do maybe an, an interview with her either on the blog or on the podcast. So, all right, guys, I'll talk to you later.